Hey everyone, this is Penny, Penny Ann Creations. How are you today? I hope you are having a beautiful day. Everyone, I received my box of items. I ordered a Lion brand and I am, I am so happy about something. I'll show you after, after the yarn. Come on, if I move my leg, I am going to run into the tripod. Okay, so this is, do I have to, I have to cut it? Yeah, let me see if I can do a light tear. Oh, come on. No, no light tear. No light tear. Sometimes when they sets this together, you can get a... Really? You're gonna give me, always give me a hard time when I am on camera. Okay. The plastic is, is um, actually dull. Feels like heaven? It feels like heaven. Okay, so this is the Lion brand. Feels like, feels like heaven. It's a new soft favorite, they saying. Two hundred and forty-six yards, one hundred percent nylon, and as I mentioned before, Lion Brand was the first to introduce nylon in the industry, and of course, you need that for stretch, especially socks. So this is dusty pink. Mm hmm. It is a dusty. It's not bright. Is dusty. A light three. A knit needle four, crochet hook of five, machine washable, lay flat to dry. Mm hmm. So I picked up a bag of these. So this is new on my list of Lion Brand yarns. So this is a new collection for me. I'm not sure how long this has been out, but also I have, I'm thinking that this is black. This is black. Why are you, it is. Okay. I'm supposed to cut it from down that way because that makes it easier. Oh, that's pretty. That is pretty. Looks like it has a little gray going through it. Mm-hmm. It's really nice. Yeah. Choco. That's why they had I, I see the gray because of charcoal color. Mm-hmm. Pretty. I wonder how is this is too strong for these two colors. Mm-hmm. Maybe a gray in there break that black up. There to go. And what else? I picked up, oh no, this is, I know, this is the latest yarn right here. Cotton Bamboo. Let me just open this one up. Little corner. Enough to get the scissors in there. If I can see the hole. There we go. 
straight across. It's a twist yarn. So this is the cotton bamboo linen. Mm-hmm. I have linen. Linen yarn. Um, I brought from Premier years ago. And it is very stiff. I got a good deal for it. Um, someone told me if you go to the yarn store, that thing will cost a fortune. Because after you wash it, it softens up. Um, buy enough to match a dye lot. That's what they're saying over here. Okay, let me tell you what this is. This is a number two. Mm-hmm. A number two. Did I assume this was a three? Hmm. Don't remember. 164 yards, everyone. Net needle 3.5 and a crochet hook on it is a 5. So this must be a drapey, something that drapes. Because as you know, we would never use a 5 on a 2. But that should come out really nice that's a pretty color and the color is i just see a lot number what is this color color mauve mist is right over the scan number mm -hmm. that's pretty 164 and i picked up six and I'm glad I did because it says to make sure you get the same lot number for your project. Mm-hmm. That is pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. I was able to get 30% off because they reduced it. And then I had $20 in rewards. So that was nice. Mm -hmm. Another brand, another type of yarn to be put in with my Lion Brand collection. This, I showed you this one before. This is Let's Get Cozy Lazy. That's what this is. And someone said that they was not going to have this on their site. It was only going to be at certain stores. But I found this on the website. So I guess that wasn't true. Mm -hmm. So I picked it up because I already had this. And again, this is 100% polyester. 179 yards. A medium four knit needle six and a crochet hook is a six and this color is taupe but I wasn't sure how many I had so I think I may have enough for a project I just have to check in a in the box because it's still in a box it's in the Joann's box that I ordered these from and I think I had a bag it wasn't a box I had a bag because I I said I had $35 to spend. Mm -hmm. This nylon seems so stretchy. So stretchy. So this is not new to the crew. It's recently new. But our reorder. Let's say that. Reorder. Oh, that's pretty. That, that bamboo cotton. For me, it has new yarn that I am interested in. Just don't feel like spending $75 for free shipping. And this one. I don't have all the um, 
I didn't put the particulars on this. I ordered this off um, Silk City um, Line Brand. They brought the company, High End Yarn Company, out of Patterson. And once a year, they will have a sale. Mostly sold their yarns on combs. And it wasn't no $5 sales. It was, you know, $50, $60, $75 dollars for those combs. And according to the knitters, that was an excellent deal. So Line Brand brought the company. And I was interested in this yarn. And this yarn cost me $13 dollars it is considered a finger worm weight a dry clean only 100 i think it's um bamboo and on cotton can't remember because it's nothing on a label and i said i was going to write it on the label because i will not remember and a ribbon citrine is the color mm-hmm so being that I stuck my toe in the water, I have to go back and order nine more. Mm-hmm. You cannot use a discount on this, but I can use my rewards points as they grow. And this is supposed to be 2,100 yards. I don't think so. I really don't think so. That's what it says. So I don't think so. I'm not sure. They said this is a pound. I have to weigh this. It doesn't feel like it's 2,100 yards. But it is a one, so. Mm -hmm. But that is pretty, okay? Almost dropped it on the floor. But that is pretty. And it feels very nice. And I did crochet some of it up. And it was fine. Worked out. No problem with crocheting. No problem with taking it apart. I did it a couple of times. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you make something very nice for yourself. You know? Sometimes you make something nice for yourself. And the thing that I am mostly excited about is these cards. I saw these cards on Lion Brand website and I have to do a inventory of my Lion Brand. I have to do it because yesterday, Monday when I came upstairs, to make that corner to corner blanket. And I said, you know something? I'll use the ice cream yarn from Lion Brand. And I had one big pink, and then I had three small purples and three small other colors. And it was not enough yardage. And like I said, I didn't feel like going downstairs. So if I would have some type of inventory on what I have then I could have made a decision quickly about what colors I wanted to use but I don't have that and I need to to get going with that because Lion Brand yarn is everywhere it is everywhere and I just keep ordering the same color over and over thinking that I don't have enough of it and I do or thinking I, uh, I'm never trying to get every color of something, but always, sometimes it works out that way for me. So, I noticed these right on, on the web, and I was so happy, because this is going to make organizing my yarn so much better. So right here, this is feels like butter. And that's actually the yarn from Periwinkle and Sea Green. They tell you the information on the card, the polyester 100 percent is the medium four, 218 yards. And all of the colors, 
that Lion Brand sold, or maybe some of them may be discontinued, is included on this chart. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm looking at this and it says number 158 limit. I can look at that and I can feel that and I can decide whether or not I want to use that to make something. Or I can use I can take the lemon and see what other colors I can add to that color to make my project. And then I can look at my list and see how many lemons I have and, and how many browns I have and will that be enough for me instead of me going through bags and boxes and who knows else trying to find this stuff so when I saw this I was over the moon this is scarfy nice and protected now, if you want to use this, if you want to purchase this to buy your yarn, that's another good idea to do it, to use. But I want to do it just for inventory. And there go the scarfy. Mm-hmm. It lists the color of the yarn and the 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 um the number. And it also gives you the information about the yarn. And there go the remaining colors. I wasn't aware that um, this existed until last week when I when it popped up. I saw it when I was going through. I go through every um, category Lion Brand have. And this is where I, I found it. I, I know I saw this before for thread. They have this for thread and they have this for carpet. But I wasn't aware that the industry has this for yarn. Mm-hmm. It is so much better. While looking at this, this is so much better than looking at the web. Mm-hmm. This is actually looking at true yarn. Whoever put this together, this is time consuming. So I'm so excited about this. I'm not going to open all of them because I did purchase quite a few. Only thing I wish I they would have had is the Mandela. And I know some of us has tons of Mandela yarn. Look how pretty this um, cotton yarn is. Mm-hmm. And I have a lot of the 24 cotton, and I don't know what I have of that, of the 24 cotton. Mm-hmm. And these are all of the colors that was made. It really looks nice. If you, you know, I don't know how the camera is projecting it, but the yarn is just nice and fresh and as if it's, it's real yarn. So it is, I'm just impressed with this. I am definitely impressed. Mm -hmm. So I'm not sure. I think most likely I will put some holes in the side and put it in a binder. I'm not sure yet how I'm going to do that. And I have to create a form in Word about each yarn and where it's located in my house. So some of these were uh, 99 cents, a dollar 99, and some of them was 2.97, something like that. So this is the ice cream. This is the big scoop. This is the nap time bonus. This is similar to the yarn I'm working with with the big scarf. You can see that's polyester. Mm-hmm. Heartland, heartland thick and quick 
And this is the feel like butter, but this is the bonus one. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited to get this. This is the chubal. Let me just see. Hold on, I just want to see how many colors I have. I know this is, let me take you up a little bit, a little bit. Can I take you up more? Yeah. Oh, my finger is right there. That's Trooper. Mm-hmm. That's Trooper. I definitely know that. And I have Nubo over there. Kobo next to the Trooper. Mm-hmm. Really nice. Oh, look at all these beautiful colors, everyone. And I don't have nowhere near all these colors. I see the pink and the white and the brown and the, and the, I want to call it beige, but it's called in the sand and khaki. And then the slate, I see mushroom and tan mm -hmm. and light pink. Those are the colors I have. Mm -hmm. A lot of them I don't have. Really nice. Really nice. Impressive. So my goal is to get all of them, especially if I have the yarn. I'm just doing it for inventory, like I said. I'm not using this to order as an ordering device. I'm just using it for my inventory because a lot of stuff I already have. And this is a Comfrey Cotton Blend. And they just had a lot of these on sale, remember? Mm -hmm. I don't think I have the red, which is the poppy. If I do, it's very minimum. I know I have the blue and definitely a ton of whipped cream because you know Calvin's bringing me that every month. And this is also some more inside. This is the cotton blend number five. And this is the yarn that Hobby Lobby sells under a different brand and it is exactly the same yarn. I was given that tip and then when I went to Hobby Lobby, I picked it up and it is the exactly the same yarn. Mm-hmm. This is very nice yarn. Shawl in a ball. As we know, we definitely have too much of that. <laughs> A little Kobo. Mm-hmm. A lot of this is discontinued. Mm-hmm. I remember this came out. I was in um Lime Brown Outlet. Nubu. Mm-hmm. Now this, this sheet definitely helps me from having to write all this stuff out because it's already there available for me. So I can easy on the side of these put down how many I have of cream, buff, salmon, so forth and so on. And by looking at these cards, I can, I can automatically tell whether or not I have the yarn and how many I have. So just so excited about that it's gonna be some work to to get it done but it's gonna be worth it feels like a packer mm-hmm one thing I noticed it didn't have a lot of the LB yarns the cotton jeans and the the Mako cotton I do have some cashmere from Lion Brand. So the yarn, I didn't see a lot of, they hide the, the LB collection. Mm-hmm. And definitely I have a lot of these. Pound of Love. Of course, I doubt if I have every color, but I know I have a lot. Let me just see how many colors they list. <laughs> uh, 
That's the colors. Pound of love. Mm-hmm. Really nice. Oh, this makes my... This is going to help me out so much. It is really nice. It is definitely going to help me out. So if you're looking at this and you want to make a project with your pound of love, you just pull out your little sheet and you can plan from your sheet unless they come out with some colors. You know, they always come out with new colors and they discontinue the other colors. So you just have to mark on your sheet if they come out with a, a new color that's not on here and then you just add it to your sheet in the back so you can keep on top of what's coming out and then on the side if something that this gets discontinued you can write that say discontinued not like you can't still find the yarn because hersner's or Design Genius or the Dollar Tree, one of those may have it. Somebody always will pick it up when Lion Brand gets rid of it. Mm hmm Yep. Just imagine sitting down and it's like, oh, I want to do something. I want to make a project. I don't know what I want to do. And you just say, I'm going to go to my, go through my Lion Brand um yarn and see what I want to make to work with or you find a pattern online and you say well let me see if pound of love will work with that mm, that pattern and and go from there and also, if you're brave enough, you can do it with um, all your other yarns. Um, if you want to clip some ends and start putting them on a cardstock paper. I will use cardstock. And mimic this. That's a good idea. It's going to take you a while, but hey, a lot of times we're sitting there watching TV. You have commercials. So before you know it, you will be done. And I have to take that as my own advice. We don't eat the pizza all at one time. We eat it slice by slice. Yeah, I, I spent a lot of money on these. I spent more money on getting these than I did on the yarn because this was more important to me. I, I just, I have seven boxes on the floor of Lion Brand stuff. And I had to go into my DVNY closet that's being overtaken by Lion Brand. And I must have anywhere from eight to 10 Santa sacks in there that Calvin had to pull out. Enough is enough, Penny. <laughs> enough is enough. Okay, everyone, I'm going to have to put these back in the protective plastic that they came uh, with. Um, let me know. What do you think about um, these? You know, are you going to plan on getting some? Um, or what if you do, what are you going to use them for? Um, I'd like to know. Mine's is strictly going to be for inventory and you know if I want to work with something use pound of love and I have a shelf behind me and it's too deep that means that I can't see behind the first row and I'm not sure what yarns are behind the first row so if I look at my sheet it will be able to tell me yeah you do have uber you do have brown <laughs> A pumpkin space. Yeah. Mm hmm It's just going to be so nice to be organized. Uh-huh. I hired my husband out. No, he has um, his other stuff that um, he's been doing. But it should be fun, everyone. This tape is sticking to everything. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> it's sticking to everything. Everyone, thanks a lot for supporting me. Thanks for your thumbs up. Thanks for sharing my channel. Appreciate it very much. Enjoy your day. Bye.